Hello and welcome to our quick video on web forms in Fresh Sales. In this video, we'll cover everything about creating and customizing web forms to capture leads. The best part, it involves zero dev effort. Let's start off with defining web forms. Web forms are online forms placed on your website that capture visitors as leads. Are web forms really necessary? Absolutely. Your website visitors are folks who are looking to learn more about your business, which makes them the right leads for your sales teams to close. You could be using web forms for lead sign up, contact us, event registrations, or subscribe to the newsletter. It's important to capture your web form submissions in the CRM. With Fresh Sales, you can automatically capture every website visitor as a lead or a contact. There are two kinds of web forms in Fresh Sales, classic forms and smart forms. With classic forms, you can create a form from scratch, customize it and place it anywhere on your website. Where a smart form help you integrate any existing form you may have on your website with Fresh Sales. Now let's see how we can create a web form from scratch with classic forms. To create a web form, go into the admin module, click on web forms and then classic forms and click create web form. First item on the list, give your form a name. Let's call us the sign up form. Now here we have a text field asking for an email address. Each time the form is submitted and a record is created or updated, an email is sent to this email address. You can make your forms GDPR compliant by adding an opt-in checkbox. Use this to get consent from your visitors for the data you collect on your form for future communications. Add a display message for this field. Over here, choose what happens when the submit button is clicked. Display a custom message or redirect the user to a new URL by keying it here. For every website visitor that completes and submits the web form, you can create the record type as a lead or contact and associate a deal with it. Either way, fight pesky duplicates by checking this little box here and Fresh Sales will update existing records with newer values. For this form, let's go with leads. Let's customize the look and feel of our form. Give your form a title, which in our case will be sign up here. Add a short description and customize the submit button label, which is a required field. By default, it's labeled submit, but you can customize it to say something else too. Next, let's add them fields. Note that these fields are the existing fields from the lead profile. So you can choose as many fields as you like. But with web form fields, the less, the better. So add the most relevant fields you'll need for your business. The default fields on a new form will include the name, email, and phone number. The last name is set as the required field for any record in Fresh Sales. You can set certain fields as required so that the visitor needs to mandatorily enter the value for this field. So in this form, I'll go ahead and set email as a required field so I can start engaging with my leads. You can also set a field as hidden. Now, this is mostly used in cases when the default value for the field can be set by the form creator. Let's look at an example. You're running a paid ad campaign to drive registrations and use a web form. You can set the campaign field value to paid ad and hide the field from the form. When a lead lands on the registration page from the ad, the lead field campaign is populated as paid ad in fresh sales. This makes it easier for you to identify and filter leads based on the source. And with that, we've created our sign-up form with all the needed fields. Now, let's make it sparkle. It's time to add some color to the web form. So let me scroll to the left pane here, where I can customize everything from the font of the form to the color of the submit button. So let's choose a pastel yellow for the web form here and a cool blue for the field names and a subtle green for the submit button. Now let's have a quick preview of how our form looks. And yes, here's the form we created from scratch. Looks good, doesn't it? But yes, that yellow may be a bit too much. Now, the good thing is that these choices are not set in stone. I can simply head back to my form and customize all of it. Click on the edit option on the web form and make all the changes you need. And that's about creating a web form from scratch. Now, what if you already had a web form on your website, but it isn't integrated with Fresh Sales? That's when you use smart forms. The smart form feature helps integrate your existing web form with Fresh Sales. What does this mean? Well, if you have a form on your website, like a contact us form, demo request, or just about any form where website visitors can submit information, but it's not captured in Fresh Sales, then smart forms is the bridge that brings the two together. Integrating your form with Fresh Sales 
removes the need for you to manually add the visitor as a lead or a contact to the CRM. It also helps you reduce the response time from when the form is submitted to when you actually reach out to them. Because with smart forms, everything happens in real time. So let's get cracking. From the admin settings, visit the web forms module and then smart forms. In this page, you'll see a code snippet and this powerful little bit is all you need. Copy this. Go to the landing page where your form exists and add it to the HTML head tag of your existing web form. That's it. You can test the success of the integration by adding the URL here. It confirms if Fresh Sales is receiving information from your website. Now, the cool thing about smart forms is that not only does it capture your leads in Fresh Sales, it also gives you context. A website visitor may perform multiple different actions on your website before they submit a form. Visit different pages, click on links and download resources. Event tracking in Fresh Sales tracks these activities so you can know your leads' interests by knowing what they looked at on your website. Let's look at an example, shall we? Here's an e-commerce website, Acme Inc., with a sign-up form on the homepage that's integrated to Fresh Sales. So I'll enter my info here to sign up. Now I browse their product catalog. Ooh, a Kindle. Let me add that to my wish list. I do want to buy a fitness band, so I'll add that to my cart. That's my shopping done. When I search for this lead here in Fresh Sales, it is automatically captured and I can view the website activities on the activity timeline. The links clicked, items purchased, all of it. This right here is a gold mine of information for any salesperson. You can use these insights to engage with the lead. So there you have it. Now you know all about creating web forms from scratch, integrating your existing web forms with Fresh Sales and how to gain context about your leads activities on your website. Happy selling!